Well, come in. Don't be shy. Hey, look, I can't, I can't stay long. Ah, it's a great flat, Lucy. It's uh, interesting. Is that a polite way of saying you don't like it? Oh, no, I do. I do like it very much. It's, uh, it's fascinating. Well, it's not much, but I've tried to make it my own. Yeah, I can see that. Hey, look at this. I used to have art just like this when I was a kid. I did. <laughs> I doubt it. <laughs> That's from Peru. I went there once when I was younger. Well, I've never been to Peru. I've been to Brazil. I went to Rio. Now, let me tell you that. That's a great city. Oh, I keep forgetting you've sailed the seven seas. Yeah, but I didn't see much of it from where I was, did I? No, I suppose not. So, uh, I painted that. I did, in fact, uh, all of these are mine, except for, except for that one. Well, you'd never mentioned it. You never told me you were a, an artist. Was, well, was an art student. Yeah, I did a year and a bit at college, but I had to leave for personal reasons. Oh, that's a shame. You like them? Yeah, I do. I do like them. I mean, you know, I don't pretend to know anything about them, but I, I do like them, yeah. Just a gut reaction? Yeah, if you like. I think that's the way more people should look at things. There's too much talking in this world. Yeah. Hey, look, Lucy, you don't mind me looking around your flat like this, do you? No, no. Help yourself. Uh, I'll put the kettle on. Ah, the coffee. Oh, so it was the genuine offer, then, the coffee. Are you disappointed? No. Not if it's good coffee. Oh, it will be good. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I don't doubt that. So, uh, all this, it doesn't frighten you off, then? No. I'm intrigued. By what? By your lifestyle, your conversation, everything. I've had a great night. It's not over yet. Uh, so when's this next pickup for Mickey Edwards? <laughs> yeah, well, actually, that one won't from Mickey. That was one of mine. Get on. I'm telling you, it's right. I didn't get to see Mickey, so I picked one myself. Who well, cares who picks them? As long as they win. Aye, <laughs> come on, Vic. Give the little man his due. You couldn't pick that in a thousand years. I'm telling you, it was mine. Mm. <laughs> oh, uh, gin and tonic, please, love. And make that a double. Come here. You are a real cracker. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know, I've always been telling them to listen to his mum. Hey, and now I believe her. Keep the change. Thanks. Yeah, it'd be a different story if it had lost. Aye, that goes for both of us. Oh, yeah, sorry. It's all right, we're in the green, isn't it? Yeah, but he's bound to be pig sick, isn't he? Nature of the job. You win one day, you lose another. Best go and give him a quick ring, though. Let him know. It's great coffee, this. What did I tell you? Yeah, me, I normally drink instant. Oh, I always prefer the real thing. <laughs> oh, yeah, well, I suppose you can't really beat the real thing, can you? <laughs> oh, sorry. Would you mind if I take it? Yeah. Oh, I love. Um, yeah, not bad. I I'm really sorry. I didn't want to ruin your evening. It's just I thought I'd better let you know. You know that horse? The one Vic was tipping. Like one. Yeah. Some you win, some you lose, eh? Where am I? Well, I'm in the uh I'm in the bowling alley, love. Where else? Yeah, it is. It's it's quiet because I'm in the gents at the minute. Oh <laughs> sorry, I didn't realise. That's okay. Oh yeah, all right, love. No, no, don't don't worry. It's not going to break me, is it, Shell? OK. And you. Bye. It's your girlfriend. Yeah. So are you going? No, not if you don't want me to. I think you could do with a drink. I think you're right. So, uh, so what is that stuff then? A fancy one. Oh, I don't know, you know, it looks lethal. It's grappa. I brought it back from Italy. Yeah? yeah? You get about a bit, you, don't you? Oh, not enough. You do, you get about more than me. So, will you risk it? Oh. Why not? Try anything once, me. Salute. Salute. Well, you speak the language and everything. I try. Cheers. Oh, that tastes, that's <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> That a bit much for you. Ah, oh, what is that stuff made of? I don't know, pips, stalks, leftovers, I think. Well, it's uh, it's certainly distinctive. Well, you can get a posh variety, but I prefer the basic stuff. Yeah? You're an unusual girl. You think so? Yeah, I do. You keep surprising me. I like surprising people, particularly people I like. Yeah? I've got your flat, Lucy. I haven't seen it all yet. Yeah, well, I don't know, maybe next time, eh? You're going home? Yeah. 
think I should, don't you? You'll miss the full tour. Look, Lucy. Well, you don't take any prisoners, do you? Look, you're free to leave any time you want. Yeah, I don't want to. Good. Any regrets? No, I don't. It's great. So what's wrong? It's just that I don't normally do this, you know. What about Shelley? Shell? No. She's steady as a rock. Yeah, maybe that's what she thinks about you. Yeah, with good reason. Because I usually am. So why me? Well, you're special. You're different. Oh, I don't know. Don't ask me. Do you find me fascinating? Yeah, I find you fascinating. But I don't want to hurt Shelley, you understand? Good. Break her heart if she knew I'd done this. Oh, so you're not going to tell her? No. Well, what she doesn't know, it's not going to hurt her, is it? Well, that is a typical male response. No, I mean it. If I told her, it wouldn't be for her. It'd just be me, you know, shedding me guilt. No, oh, so you feel guilty? Well, well, yeah, I do a bit, but, you know, I don't regret it. Well, that's good, cos neither do I. You've got to seize these moments when they come. They're few and far between. Ah, oh, come on. Good-looking girl like you, you must get loads of offers. Well, none that I want to take. Come on, then, so why me? Well, I fancied you. Mm -hmm. Thought there might be hidden depths. Is that before or after you knew I was a submariner? See? <laughs> <laughs> you make me smile. <laughs> You're a great girl. And you are my deep. You think I'm deep? Oh, yes. Or you wouldn't be here. Oh. Thanks, Harry, love. Must have taken a right hammer in tonight on that horse, your bloke. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Unless, of course, he laid it off. No. Tommy stood the lot. So you'll be putting in for some overtime then, eh? Uh, I don't think so. I've seen enough of this place already. Yeah, well. Soon be home. <sighs> yeah. And I can't wait. So do you always wear a tie? Why? What, well, do you think it's too formal? Not necessarily. So what, what, do you, you think I'm uptight, eh? Maybe just a little. Mm. Well, that's probably because of all those years before the mast. No. Conning Tower. Sorry. Mm. I'd like to have seen you in uniform. Oh, well, play your cards right. Might even bring it round for you. You'd have to want to see me again to do that. Oh, yeah. And I'd have to want to see you. So do you want to see me? No. <laughs> yes, very much. Very funny. But no strings, no expectations, no big declarations. Just fun, yeah? Yeah, sure, just fun. Hiya. You're home early. I thought you were going on to the casino. Nah, the others went. To be honest, I didn't fancy it, you know, not after your, your phone call. Oh, I'm sorry, love. I didn't mean to ruin your evening. Oh, you didn't? No, I, uh, I enjoyed it. Oh. Well, it's nice to see you anyway. And you? You're, um, not too tired, I hope. Not too tired for what? I don't know what you mean. I think you do. Hey, look, love, let me just grab a quick shower. No, no, don't have a shower. Just come to bed. Look, come on, look, I've been bowling. Oh, well, all right, then. Don't be too long. No, be two minutes. <laughs> oh. Peter? Yes, love? I do love you, you know. Yeah. I love you too. 